the Sophonity, where science and a reckless disregard for survival go hand in hand. Yeah, that sounds pretty good and is how I like to play, but uh, I think I want to do something a little different for this video. Uh, who should we go with? Taking over the galaxy may be a little risky, but it's fun, and you'll get rich. Yeah, okay, fun is a thing video games should have. Let's do this. I really love this loading screen. Like, in the background, you got all these cool spaceships and loading docks and stuff, and then, like, in the foreground over here, you got... I, I thought that it was, um, my turn to eat today, brother. It was, uh, your turn to eat yesterday. Here, here, take this. Actually, it, um, it was, it was... Your turn to eat yesterday. <laughs> Your turn to shut the fuck up. Uh, here, no, take this. Break the rules that tied my hands. But he ignores the codes. This is the intro to a race in a 4X game. And the best part is the rest of the intros are, like, normal. They're like, we were forced out of our homes because of a cataclysmic event, so we hope to find a new home among the stars. Or, we were also forced out of our homes because of a cataclysmic event and hope to find a new home among the stars. But this is just like, I knew the kid was trouble when he popped Johnny for making the wrong kind of joke. Probably should have seen it coming when he started snorting coke up his asshole, but hindsight 2020. Should have kicked him out the instant the hammer hit the bullet, but truth is, the kid made me a lot of money. And I know I'm getting hung up on this intro, but there were people who complained head, about it. Complained. Who ruled as if it wasn't the best thing that they'd ever seen in their lives. It is hey there, I'm Jeremy Landgrab, and, well, y'all know exactly why I'm here. There we go. Welcome to turn one, boys. This man, machine thing, just just wants me to give him all of my money. Alright, alright. How about this? How about this? That good? We good? Your declaration. He doesn't even know what happened. Nothing. I want this. Yeah, that's good. Hey, wait a second. That was a $440. What the hell, man? We got duped. For real though, guys, you gotta watch out for space pirates. Well, happened again. And this time it's on the very same land that I was grabbing. And he's kicking me out. How did this... How did I even end up like this? All right, hey, hey, you want to be friends? No? Well, okay. Then get off my lawn and stop killing my ships. Cycle. All right. You mess with me, I ain't gonna take that sitting down. Yeah. Have fun signing papers, bitch. <laughs> Hey, I know you're a little peeved about the bureaucratic obstacles, but, uh, you know, let me make it right here. I heard your broodmother was having her 200 billionth child, so, uh, take this, uh, take this little gift from me here. I don't know why they even, like, give me this choice. I in what universe would I not want to take this man? Yes, of course I want you. Come on, you're my new hero now. Have you ever been so mad at someone that you sent them the same death threat? Three times in a row? Hey, why don't you and me try being friends? Hey, take this, a gift from me to you. Go buy your, uh, go buy your wife something nice uh -huh. for me, like, like a Christmas ornament or something. Aw, he's jealous. That's, uh, that's, uh, pretty steep, my friend. I don't, I don't know if I can afford that. Let's try this, let's try this. Um, 800 bucks. How's that sound? Your good? Alright, we good. Well, I think if we learned anything from last game, it's that sometimes you try to grab land in your own place, but then you run into a wall and these particular guys right here won't let you grab any more land, so you just move on down here where there's lots and lots of land to be grabbed. Okay, so this one's a little bit more difficult. We got a... Uh, Got General Save the Trees here, uh, some sort of horrible bug monster, and uh, a different horrible bug monster, but this one doesn't want to fight. Hmm. Horrible bug monster one has this thing where he uh, pesters people until his ships are the very best. 
That's that's pretty good. Okay. You know what? Yeah, I'm gonna go with Horrible Bug Monster number one. I feel like he's the best pick. Yeah. Am I sure? Yeah. Okay. All right. Oh God, he's so much worse than I thought he was. <laughs> this guy's gonna have like no problem. How did those guys? He can uh, he can strangle like six of them at one time. Baby, baby, I know you hurt. I know you hurt, but I'm gonna make things right, okay? I'm gonna make things right. Hey, listen, here, just, uh, just take this. Just take this, okay? Buy yourself a new box of cube wax. You're gonna feel so much better, I promise. I love you, you know that. Hey, so, uh, like I said earlier, you gotta watch out for space pirates, and, uh, yeah, this, uh, this is uh, exactly why. Look, they're, they're everywhere. So I'm gonna help this guy deal with his space pirate problem. It really shouldn't be too much of a hassle. It's not something that, you know, I can't pull off. I pretty much am gonna basically win in this battle anyway. Hey, watch out for space pirates. I'm not kidding. You can- Oh my god! See? Easy! You hear this philosophical question a lot, or what is the price of victory? The answer's about Three million bucks rounded up. Yeah, I'm gonna make that next turn. So, uh, yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm doing pretty good. And there it is. There it is. I won. These guys, these other guys, they don't matter. They ain't economy. I'm economy. I made the money. I rolled the nickels, man. Yeah. Um. Yeah. This don't matter. This also don't matter. <sighs> Who cares? There we go, that's the good stuff right there. That's what wins your games. That's what wins your games. You know, I'm gonna skip the rest of this and yeah, there we go. I won with money. I won with money. That's all you need. All you need in the world is money and I won with it. I still ain't happy though.